Bush. Number three, blackmail gate. Britain's newspaper, The Independent, reports that the Iraqi government is not as interested in the so-called strategic alliance with us as Mr. Bush and Secretary Rice have suggested. In fact, they're not interested in all in having 50 American military bases there pretty much till the end of time. But conveniently, the paper says we're blackmailing them. There is $20 billion worth of outstanding American court judgments against Iraq. But there's a presidential order immunizing Iraq from those claims, all of which date back to the Saddam Hussein dictatorship. The Independent reports that if the Iraqis don't agree to the strategic alliance, Mr. Bush will end the immunity. And since the Iraqi government has $50 billion in the Federal Reserve Bank in New York, it wouldn't have any chance of keeping the $20 billion out of the jurisdictions of the U.S. courts. Number two, the president may not be rational gate. Comedian Rush Limbaugh dropping in a little aside about Iran. I had talked to a bunch of his donors, and they said to me that they can't see Bush leaving office with Iran's a problem, a nuclear problem. He's not out of office yet, either. You doubt that the implication there is war with Iran, or if he can't fool some of the people on that one, again, bomb Iranian nuclear facilities, then check out the next one. Number one, the president may not be rational gate. In General Ricardo Sanchez's new book, Wiser in Battle, there is contained his story of watching in horror on a teleconference after four contractors were killed in Fallujah in 2004. Sanchez said Mr. Bush's pep talk to the generals was confused, to say the least. Kick ass! If somebody tries to stop the march to democracy, we will seek them out and kill them. We must be tougher than hell. This Vietnam stuff, this is not even close. It is a mindset. We can't send that message. It's an excuse to prepare us for the withdrawal. This is a series of moments, and this is one of them. Our will is being tested, but we are resolute. We have a better way. Stay strong. Stay the course. Kill them. Be confident. Prevail. We are going to wipe them out. We are not blinking. What is your major malfunction? <laughs> Good Lord, he used every platitude and cliche in there except Mama said knock you out and employees must wash hands. <laughs>